Ah, uh, good evening. Um, sitting up here in big old Knoxville, Tennessee. Hey, uh, got on my YouTube tonight and had a special request from a subscriber. Uh, want to know how to get paid for loads, um, how to book loads. Um, so I'm going to do the best I can to show you the two load boards I use, a couple of the rate comps um, that I've run this week, and um, uh, kind of give you an idea how all that works uh, and the, um, the factoring company I use uh, and, and how I factor my loads. So uh, hold on tight. Here we go. Uh, that's the cockpit right there. But anyway, all right, so... Uh, what I use is, I use DAT and truckstop.com, all right? Now on the DAT, it's uh, $49 a month, okay? Uh, and you have to refresh it with that refresh button there about every 10 minutes. All right, so what you'll do is uh, on a new search, uh, so you log in, get on your search, all right, like right here, where I'm looking to get out of Knoxville. All right, 150 miles is what I'll deadhead. Alabama, Georgia, North Carolina, South Carolina, Tennessee, and Virginia is where I'm willing to go. I like to stay in the southeast. Flatbed and flatbed air ride. 48 foot, 48,000 pounds, looking for full loads. Trying to stay away from them partial so them hotshot boys can still get their stuff. Uh, tomorrow's pickup date. And I don't look more than a day out. All right, so you're gonna hit search, okay? All right, so you're gonna jump over here and the first thing that pops up is your age, okay? The newest thing that's been put on there. I always jump over here to offers and it shows the biggest money first, all right? And then I jump over here to deadhead miles, all right? So, uh, right here we got one from Knoxville, Tennessee, going back to Mary, 24,000 pounds. Snyder National is who you're going to use, is who the broker is, okay? Now there's no price on this, so you'll have to call, all right? I don't run my truck for less than $2 a mile. Well, I'm not going to say that because I have. But if I know <clears throat> it's going to get me somewhere to where I'm going to make upwards close to three bucks a mile or more then yes I will sometimes you got to do what you got to do um, so you know it's it's you know Knoxville it's right here 150 miles all right so you figure you know if you don't want to run less than two dollars a mile well that's 300 bucks to marry now, I guarantee that loads paying five all right uh, like this in here, Harrington, Tennessee, 41 miles away to Nashville. I don't want to go to Nashville. That's the wrong way. Um, but uh, 142 miles, uh, you know, 550 bucks. Okay. So, but what I do is through my bro uh, factoring company is I'll go over here and I'll get their MC number. And I'll show you how to do that with some pictures. Um, but... Uh, I'll take and put their MC number in and it pulls up if they're approved or not approved or uh, call the office or whatever uh, before I book the load because uh, these loads don't go away as fast as the hot shot loads um, so you you have a little bit more time uh, to do some thinking some uh, what your navigation is going to be you know what route you're going to have to take you know things like that so the other one I use is truckstop.com which is to me is a little bit more user-friendly but I'm not gonna lie to you I get a lot more stuff off of that um, I'd say about 70% of my loads come off of that which I really like their their uh, their app for iPhone and Android uh, they've got an awesome app um, so it's basically the same thing here. Um, I just did a uh, GPS search here, Kimberland Heights, Tennessee, which is right outside of Knoxville. That's where I'm at. 150 mile radius, uh, pick up tomorrow, uh, and going to uh, the same states that I had mentioned earlier. 
All right, so we're going to look at distance. Okay, so uh, there's that Knoxville to Marion again, and they got it. They got it listed with Schneider again over on this board. Uh, you got Maryville to Jacksonville, North Carolina, 750 bucks, a dollar 55 mile, 18 foot long, 3,400 pounds. That's a hot shot load. Okay, I'm not going to touch that. Uh, but anyway, just kind of go down through, just scroll down through here, and um, you know, there's 68 loads within 150 miles. Um, and you just kind of scroll down there and see what you're interested in. All right, so that's how I do that. All right, so then uh, when it comes to uh, your rate comps and stuff, um, you know, here's a prime example of one I run for DSV. Uh, this one went from uh, Salisbury to Duluth, Georgia. All right, um, 260 miles for 500 bucks is a uh, buck 92 a mile. All right, but when I went down there to pick that load up, it's because I already found this load. This is through PLS. I run 145 miles. Okay from uh, Houston, Georgia to uh, Hicks Grove, all right, up Mooresboro, 145 miles, 482 a mile. Paid me 700 bucks, all right? So, you know, 482 a mile ain't bad. Let's see what this one is. Ah, oh, there's another one. Uh, now this is, a, this is a load of brick I got out of Salisbury. Um, four hundred and forty dollars is the total pay for eighty-one miles. Comes up to be five forty-three a mile. Uh, it took me about an hour and a half to run that. <clears throat> uh, and here I did another brick load uh, down to Duluth. Uh, so that was another buck ninety-two a mile. And then I picked this load up and brought it back today to Charlotte. 225 miles, 266 a mile, and that was from Norcross, Georgia, to Charlotte, North Carolina. All right, and that was address to address. As soon as I drop that load off, that block load I took down this morning, or last night, I, I took it down last night. I took this load down last night, okay? Stayed there overnight. Uh, 10 miles away, I picked up um, this load right here back to Charlotte. 10 miles away, picked that load back up to Charlotte. Got it up there and dropped it off at the uh, airport. Picked up this load right here from Charlotte, which was about 10 miles away from the airport, going to Knoxville. And I'm in Knoxville right now. So I'll drop this one off. Uh, my receiving appointment is at 8 a.m. Um, so as soon as they get me unloaded, um, I'll be on the load board out here in their parking lot. My time clock will not start until I book me a load. And when I book me a load, then I'll, I'll go get it wherever it takes me. So as far as the factoring goes, um, I use OTR Capital. It's, uh, they charge three percent, and what they do is is uh, like uh, this one right here, for example. I take with their with their app. You'll fill out all the information on the front, and I should be installed on a picture here. Um, and then you'll choose ACH, which is, you know, direct deposit into your account. They've got all your information. And then I take a picture with their app of this, okay, and of the bill of lading, okay? And this is just extra paperwork that the broker sent me for some reason. I don't take a picture of that. Um, but you've got your uh, rate comp signed, and you've got your signed bill of lading. Okay, you signed it, they signed it, where you dropped it off. And you shoot that over to o OTR, your money is in your account within 24 hours. 
unless you want it wired, they'll wire it to you the same day, as long as you get it in by two o'clock, but that's an extra 30 bucks, so I don't do that. Um, but yeah, it works out real good. Everybody's real friendly there. Uh, I use Ashley and Catherine, that team. They got a couple other folks on their team, but um, OTRs who I use, uh, I've had a really great experience with them, real helpful folks. So, but anyway, I hope that helps. Um, if you have any questions, comments, um, something I missed, um, or you want me to go into a little bit more detail about something, uh, just shoot me a comment below. I'll take care of it. Old girl getting some new steer tires put on her today. The other ones wasn't wore out, but man, I had a balancing issue. Sippy's new Kelly's doing good.